So we all know that the um the track like actual track event started today and they had the women's prelims and round one of the hundred and like Shikari, she went out there and she slid easily like I thought she was, so like she really ain't got comp this year. But there is somebody here who went out there and is ranked number two right now out of the entire field of the women's hundred. And it's, like, surprising that she's still this ranked up, bro. Shelly Ann Fraser price is, she went out there and she is the number two fastest person so far out of all the heats. That shit is insane. Like, at nearly 40 years old, she got out the blocks and quickly just started going away from the crowd and got second place but eased up at the end. So, her... She only came behind the person in her heat who got first, Ta Lu. Bro, Shelly is still a problem. Like, a lot of athletes, when they get to this age, that's basically ancient in track years, essentially. So, for the fact that she's still, she's a unicorn, literally. Like, she is literally the LeBron of track and field. Her longevity is insane. And it's, you know how insane it is? Because her and Usain Bolt are the same age. She's only a few months younger than Bolt. And you saw how Bolt crashed and burned his last race just simply due to how his body was getting older. She is still competing at a high level. This is crazy, bro. And I already know that she she eased up at the end. So when she knows, like, she's been to so many Olympic meets that she just knows how the game works. Essentially, like, how people who go to the NBA Finals, who've been to the NBA Finals more times than another team, they're going to have more experience. It's the same way for her. Like, she is literally one of the biggest threats to anybody who has any chance of winning, like Shakari Richardson, because her presence on the track just already is just setting a tone for the race. Like, her experience, her race intelligence, and, like, everything about her, she's just a contender, and she's not going to let you just burn her. And, like, she announced that this is her final um olympic appearance and after this she's gonna retire to just go chill with her family and her kids and i know shakar richardson and all them other young girls are praying they're they are privileged they're probably like how everybody is waiting for lebron to retire because they're tired of them just dominating and this shit is crazy though like almost 40 years old and you're still able to come out here and run against people who are like half your age and you're just able to like, you're still able to just cook just like it's nothing new. Now, her teammate, uh, Sharika Jackson, she she chose to like step out of the hunt. So I don't really see that much comp for Shikari. But at the same time, this is like another easy spot for uh, the pocket rocket to come in there and take a medal. So she's definitely going to place. Because um, the way she just went out there and just casually ran the second fastest time. And I get it. It's only the first round. A lot of people are just trying to make that first or two, one, two spot and just chill. I get that. But she chilled too. So she's definitely going to place in that final. It might not be first or second, but I think she can get third. I think she can get third pretty easily. But um, let me know who y'all think is going to win and how far y'all think Shelly's going to go. And put y'all predictions in the comments.